name is Mariah Gagos, also known as Glam Gal on Instagram, and that's so weird to say because I just changed my Instagram handle, as some of you guys may have noticed. So I created this look today, and I am absolutely living for it. I have been so into like colorful up top cut creases, so I was like, you know what, today I'm going to be a little extra, add a little bit of glitter, some white liner, and maybe do some fall colors. I honestly feel like super Thanksgiving, um, but it's also pretty fallish esque I guess, because it reminds me of leaves. Um, so let me, let me know down below if you get more um, turkey vibes or leaf vibes, because... I can't tell. So I really hope that you enjoy this video. If you want to see how I got this look, then go ahead and just keep on watching. So for today's look, I'm using the Zulu palette from Juvia's Place. This is my all-time favorite colorful palette. I'm going in with the yellow shade and then taking the orange shade and lying that right next to it, just really building up a dramatic crease. I'm then taking a red shade from Makeup Forever. I'll definitely have it listed down below because I'm not too sure of it off the top of my head, and just really making sure that they look really blended. Next, I'm going to be cutting my crease with the ColourPop Concealer. I use Light 16. It's my favorite concealer to cut my crease. And I'll have this MAC brush listed down below. I'm then going to take my Dark Magic Palette from Morphe and use Poof to set my lids. This has been my favorite color for setting my lids. Honestly, it's so pretty. Next, taking a MAC Fluid Line and dip down and just lining my lash line using the tape as a guide. Then next, I'm going to take the Urban Decay Midnight Cowboy and just line... Um, half of my line, my liner, I guess. Next, taking my Derma Blend Insta Grip Jelly Primer, which is my favorite, and just priming my face. Then using my Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation because, as you can see, I need the double wear because I'm breaking out so bad. I use my Too Faced Born This Way Concealer, my Maybelline Loose Fit Me Powder, and now I'm just smoking out my lower lash line with the brown from the palette. So I'm going to take some Ardell individuals and I'm just going to pop them on my lower lash line. I like to just put some glue on the container, obviously using tweezers and just dipping them in is just what works easy. So I just pick them up and then obviously dip them in the glue. Um, just, just the tip, you know, about that much. You can like kind of see it right there. And then all you're going to do is just place it down on your lash line. That one's pretty long, but it's on the outer, so it's whatever. It's really important to also make sure that your tweezers don't have any glue on them or anything because that can really affect it. They're just a really fun way to add like a little bit more drama to your look. I'm going to use the Urban Decay 24-7 Neck Light on Lip Pencil in Gash. So there's Gash. This is actually really pretty, um, just completely colored in. And then we're going to take Milani Emotion, which is a really pretty red, deeper red lip, liquid lipstick. So I really hope that you enjoyed this video. It was actually really fun kind of trying out some new products and doing this really fall look. I am so excited for like deep burgundy fall lips and dreams and I'm just living for this makeup look right now.